Assalamualaikum and good day Dr. Rosie. I am Izian Amani binti Hasnul Hisham and today I will be presenting about experiment 4 Electronic Spectra of Nickel 2 Complexes, a D8 system. There are two objectives to be achieved in this experiment, which is the first one is to differentiate different colors of nickel 2 complexes and their electronic spectra, and the other one is to determine the delta octahedral of the nickel 2 complexes. Proceeding to the theory of the experiment, as we all know, electron absorbs energy when it excites to a higher energy level from the ground state. In this experiment, we have a compound with D8 configuration, so the electron in a D orbital on the metal need to absorb light in the near UV visible and the near IR region in order for it to excite to another higher energy D orbital. And this is what we call the DD transition. And when the DD transition occurs, a single peak will be observed in the absorption spectrum. However, different types of ligand will absorb light at different wavelengths. There are two types of ligands, strong and weak ligands. So for example, if we have a strong ligand such as cyanide attached to the metal, the difference in energy splitting of the two energy levels will be higher. So, more energy is needed for the electrons to excite. Therefore, it will absorb light with shorter wavelength values. Each specific wavelength corresponds to a different color. So based on the color wheel, the blue or purple color will be absorbed. However, this color will not be seen to our naked eyes. Instead, the color in the opposite direction of the color absorbed will be observed. So, if let's say blue is absorbed, then the orange solution will be appeared. If purple color is absorbed, yellow solution will be appeared. So, depending on the types of ligand and coordination, nickel forms colorful complexes and hence different electronic spectra. And I think that's all from me. Thank you.